Hi guys, this is Kelly Kirchberg of Divine Style, your personal fashion stylist. Today we're talking about ways that you can change up and spice up your work look so you don't get stale or look like you're wearing the same thing day after day. Women tend to go into their closets and grab the same pieces, the same pants or trousers, the same pencil skirts or work skirts and dresses over and over again maybe just swapping out their sweaters or blazers or changing out a blouse. But now we're gonna teach you these tricks of how you can truly change up your look and spice it up to look even better. You've bought the essentials. Now you want to mix and match to create new combinations of, for outfits you wouldn't typically wear. You might end up pairing the same outfit pieces together over and over again. Instead, we want you to choose different pieces in new combinations. So adding texture to your outfits always looks great. That can be done in your blazers or skirts, different fabrics or dresses. Really changes up kind of that different feel. For example, if you're wearing a monochromatic outfit, adding in black or navy, adding in a textured piece, something that's got leather in it, suede, lace, any type of different texture truly changes that up and it makes the outfit look richer and more eye-capturing. You can also add prints to your outfit, which makes it stand out a bit more at the office. So by prints, we don't necessarily mean your avant-garde floral or overly huge graphic prints or artistic prints unless that works for your office place. But you can still incorporate in prints in small, subtle ways, or go bolder with a print blouse or print dress, and then layer that over top with a blazer in a solid, neutral color, and that truly kind of elevates your look and changes it up. Next, you want to differentiate your outfits and stand out by accessorizing in new ways. Statement earrings are a great way that you can change up what you're wearing and doing and truly make your look different. So when we're talking statement earrings, there's things that seem more appropriate for the office and pieces that don't really work well. So think about what you're choosing in your statement earrings. Metallic statement earrings always look great. Something that's in a solid color always stands out. Or you can choose rich metals, those different tones. Things that are a bit more avant-garde, overly sparkly large earrings, sometimes can be off-putting, or feathers, um, tassels, too much of that can change up your look and be not appropriate for the office. But by pulling your hair back, it's a great way to style your hair in a bun or a low ponytail and really allows you to change up and showcase both your lip color and your earrings. Who doesn't love, and it's so easy to do, is to adding a simple low bun or even a high bun in your hair. Great for the office. Next, you can choose unique shoes that have interesting design details, bold prints or colors. For example, you can add a zebra print high heel or a leopard print flat or loafer. You can add a graphic print shoe, which always looks fabulous, paired with solid colors, or those that have a rich texture as well. Shoes that have studs or spikes and animal skin also look a little bit elevated and richer. So they draw your eye and really make your outfit look more head to toe, looks a little bit more pulled together just, than just wearing a classic ballet flat or a classic simple pump. So for your work bags, you also want to carry a tote, computer bag, or portfolio bag that you can easily slide your papers in, your iPad or your laptop in, but you want something that stands out and makes your outfit look a little bit more tied together. So you can do this, again, choosing a bold colored piece, something that's in a rich leather. For example, 
this season we've seen out there's some really eye-capturing um, portfolio bags and simple tote bags in bolder rich colors there's deep purples that are out burgundies rich emerald greens and those really look fabulous against um, neutral colored outfits or they pop as well when you're wearing your print pieces as we've talked about. Having that bag that looks a little bit different from what everyone else is carrying or a typical work computer bag really truly sets apart your office outfit and it gives you that pulled together stylish presence that makes you want to go further in your career and it makes people pay attention to you and your look. So also choosing colors that complement your outfits or in color palettes that work well for you. If you're someone who tends toward more neutral hues, you can find a luxurious leather bag in a deep gray, or you can find one in a neutral skin tone color that's got some embellishment or interesting pieces on it. So think about what works well for the color palette that you tend to wear and how could you incorporate that into a work bag. The last thing we want you to do is to ask yourself, do I have a head to toe look? Is, am I styled for everything from my accessories to my lipstick to my hair? Do I overall present a polished look? And that doesn't mean that you have to spend hours getting ready for work. It can be very simplistic to get dressed, throw on an easy dress or a blouse and pants or a skirt and, pant, a skirt and top and then pull your hair back in a simple low bun, add a deep bold colored lipstick and earrings and you can look really stylized and pulled together taking 10 minutes or less. Very easy tricks for how you can have that head to toe look. Think about does your bag complement your outfit? Does it stand out and look different? Or are you carrying a leather piece or a fabric satchel or bag that looks a little bit worn or dated? Simple, easy trick to modernize your look. Lastly, check and see, do your shoes really make a statement? Does it look pulled together and stylish? Do they stand out where people would be asking, where did you get those boots? Ooh, I love those high heels. That gives you that head to toe overall work look that really spices it up and differentiates you from the crowd. Now, we want you to show us and tell us about what do you wear to work that differentiates your look or what questions do you have about what to wear to the office or maybe you're changing your careers. You can add that in the comments below and also share with us on social media how your work style has changed based on what you've seen. What did you try? And use the hashtag divine style and we might feature you on our social media campaigns. Don't forget to download our workwear to evening essentials, so how you can transition from the office to go out for dinner or drinks or a night in the town with our easy, simple steps. That will be in the box below. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you on the next segment.